Thanks for joining this Read and Write for Google Chrome tutorial. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use Read and Write's Simplify feature to simplify a web page. So before we start, we want to make sure that we are logged into our TCDSB Google Chrome account. I'm going to click on my profile icon at the top here, and I can see I'm logged in because I can see my TCDSB email address. I'm also going to look out for those extensions that are available to all TCDSB students when we're logged into our accounts. And that's our Read and Write, our Equatio, and our PDF Reader extensions. So I can tell I'm all set up in Google Chrome. So let's go over to a website here where we can simplify it. But before we do so, let's take a look at how this web page first appears. So as I go through it, I can see that there's a lot of colorful text. There's a menu bar at the top here. There's an image. There's the main body of information in the center with more images, another menu on the left, quick facts, captions, and so on. So this might be a lot to take in for some readers, and you really just want to get to the main information on a page. So Read and Write can help you with that. With the Simplify feature, Read and Write can take away everything that can be distracting. So let's pull up our Read and Write toolbar by clicking once on the purple puzzle piece. I'm going to use this icon on the right here. So it's the one with the four lines and the little arrow pointing down to simplify my page. When I click on it, you'll notice that a new tab opens. And this is Read and Write's Simplify feature. It's really taken away everything that could be distracting, like those menus and icons and captions. And it's left me with the key information on that page with a couple of images. Now I can further simplify this and change my preferences by using these options underneath the toolbar. So let's go through each one starting on the left. So with Simplify, if I click on this minus button, I can further simplify the content. And you'll notice that the image has disappeared. I can keep clicking and more text will be removed. So I can click a few times and read and write will really break it down to the bare minimum of text that can be provided. And you'll know this because the button will be grayed out. So I can add and I can remove content on this page. I can also use this discover button to discover new terms. So read and write will pick out key terms on this page and underline them in purple. And when I click on it, I can see its definition. I can also change the text and the background color. So it defaults on black and white, but I can choose white on black, blue on yellow, or yellow on blue. I can also change the size and type of font. So I can decrease or increase the font and choose the type. So let's choose this one as an example. Lastly, I can choose my line spacing. So it defaults on single, but I can choose one and a half lines or double line spacing. And that's Read and Write's Simplify feature. Give it a try on a web page and see what Read and Write can do for you. Thanks for watching.